It's likely that you will remember this semester is one of the most challenging in your degree program. Getting through it successfully is evidence that with hard work and perseverance, you can overcome any barriers between you and your success. My name is Matt Hurst, and I teach organizational behavior and HR strategy. This video may be the only online evidence of the so-called Hurst Principle. Search for it online, and it's likely that you will find nothing. Yet mention it to any student whom I've had in organizational behavior, and they will likely remember it well. So what is it? I should start by stating that I did not name it. I've only given my name to a wife of 16 years, a teen daughter, and a 10-year-old son. Others have given my name to a simple idea that I have leveraged to remain calm and strategic in the most difficult of circumstances, and so can you. The so-called Hearst Principle explains a simple premise that all organizations are dysfunctional. That means you will find destructive conflict, unnecessary complexity, confusion, and avoidable crises everywhere. The most significant differences between organizations will be the level and the nature of the dysfunction that you will and others will experience together. So how will the so-called Hearst Principle help you? First, you'll stop wasting precious intellectual and emotional energy trying to avoid or eliminate dysfunction. When you try to eliminate dysfunction, you will fail and you will be unhappy. Whether it's conflict, complexity, confusion, or crisis, the secret to success is not trying to eliminate such dysfunction, but to manage and minimize it within trusting, productive relationships of lasting value. Focus your energy on identifying the people with whom you wanna manage and minimize dysfunction, and you will be happy and successful. Second, Accepting that dysfunction is present in every relationship and organization also allows you to achieve the elusive emotional agility and intelligence that you already know will be essential to your success. Finally, understanding and applying the so-called Hearst Principle will help you become a leader worth following. By accepting that dysfunction is present in every organization and by not running from it, you can also empower others to achieve amazing results with courage. It essentially means turning toward the storm to provide safety and success for others instead of turning away from the storm to find it for yourself. That means becoming a leader with courage and character. And that's the so-called Hearst Principle. Stay strong and stay well, Mavericks.